Happy Relay for Life Day, everybody. We are just moments away from kicking off the 2024 Relay for Life here at the city of Sierra Vista Band Shell. It's Sheriff Mark, it's Mayor Clea McCall, and we are going to be ready to run. And, and of course, our favorite videographer and photographer here, uh, of course. Here, we'll, we'll have you get a photo while we're live. Here, let's, let's, let's be live. It's Jeff Davenport Live, brought to you by SSBEC. Serving our community. Awesome. That's the way to do it. And that's the way to kick it off. Jeff Davenport Live brought to you by SSBEC. This thing will be going on today from 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. You can be a part of the fun, a part of the festivities, and we are just literally a minute away from doing the opening ceremonies. Our videographer here, thank you so much as I flip this sucker around. Uh, oh, there it is. There it is. Boom, shakalaka. It's all flipped around. You got that. You got that. And we'll just be going in here. Oh, I was like, where do I go? Okay, 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 perfect. I haven't come to the realization that I'm still here. Leanne, you want me to introduce you whenever you're ready? Come on over, everybody, as we are just about ready to roll for the 2024 Relay for Life. Did everybody already get a chance to take a lap or are you waiting? Are you going to take your, take your time and just wait on doing a lap? You're going to wait, right, until it's official and then we'll get this thing going. But there's only one way to get this whole event started. Welcome everyone to the 2024 Sierra Vista Relay for Love! Woo! I'll have to time that a little bit better, but thank you guys so much for being here. We've got some amazing dignitaries, very special guests to introduce to you, but none more important than every single one of you. Time is the most valuable resource we have, and we thank you for spending your time here. Can we get a big hand for all of the amazing volunteers who helped put this thing together? It's an unbelievable effort, and it gives me great pleasure to keep the applause going for the lady Emma, who's at the head of the table as part of this team here. Give it up for the one, the only, Leanne Schmidt! Hi there, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, we really appreciate it. Uh, this is our 29th year in Sierra Vista, and I'm proud to say that I've been with this organization for 26 of those 29 years. So I really appreciate all the support of our motorcycle associations, the American Legion Riders, both our post in Sierra Vista Tombstone, the Combat Veterans and Motorcycle Association, and the Black Horse Regiment. They're all here today to support us, and we really appreciate that, as well as other Legion members. So we appreciate all of you coming out today, the different groups that have helped this morning, the football team, the National Honor Society, we have the Yellow Jackets, and um, just, a, just an awesome event, and thank you so much because so many of you are, and all of you are my friends and family, and I really appreciate the support. Um, we couldn't pull it off without all of you guys, and you're the most important part, and I have to say thank you to my husband, as many of us do, because our families suffer when we do Relay, because we're so tied up getting this event taken care of, but my husband hasn't seen me in weeks. Um, he, I keep telling him I know where I live, so he does know I'm coming home, but I really appreciate it. I really appreciate Jeff Davenport and the Sheriff Mark Daniels for hosting our event again for us one more time. And the Desert Fever Band, I, absolutely. And they, they will be back two more sets within the day, so please stick around for the activities. I would like to, in, um, to introduce our ELT, our event leadership team, and I have to tell you, we pulled this event off with about six, not even 10 people running the show this year. So we used to have about 20 people doing this and we're all doing double, triple duties. And, and it's just, it's, it's been just uh, um, time consuming for us, but we just keep coming back year after year because we love it. We love our survivors and we love the support of our community. So let me introduce Tammy Sappho. She's, she says she's not our lead, but she's our lead this year and has been our lead before. We have 
Janet Warlock. She's just got a lot of marketing for us. We have Misty. She is in, she is our honorary survivor today, as well as a, an event leadership team member, John Tufty. He's also doing logistics. He's doing Dante. He's got a, He's with a team. We have Donna Horton. She's in accounting. She's doing that. We have Heather Lifa. She's doing our entertainment and activities this year. The music, all that good stuff. We have Deb Chicarella. And she is an all-around specialist. She helps anywhere. She's a port -a lady. So she's very important for everybody. And she, um, whoopsie. Okay, there we go. And she just... Um, is really a delightful lady and she is a welcome, welcome person on our team because at times we do all, all have hard times and we're trying to uh, do so many things that it really takes a lot of people to run this event. So thank you so much to everybody for coming out today. Please stick around because we have some really fun things going on today. We do some musical chairs. We will be having a frozen t-shirt contest. We're having our Mr. Relay, our Luminaria ceremony tonight where we honor those that have that have uh, fought and that are beating cancer. And we also remember those that have passed away. And we all know people who have passed away from cancer. So thank you so much for coming out to support all of us. We really appreciate it. We're gonna bring up, and do we do? We do have Miss Sierra Vista team, correct? We do. We have Miss Sierra team. That's Britton Richardson. Brit, wait, Brittany or Brittany? Brittany. Brittany. Come on up, Brittany Richardson. By the way. Brittany is not just a one-time winner of Miss Sierra Mrs. Teen. She is a two-time winner of Miss Sierra Mrs. Teen. So nice. They had to give it to her twice. In addition to Brittany Richardson, we also have Miss San Pedro Valley's Teen, Sienna Ward, here today. Woo! And a third member of royalty, that would be Miss Cochise County, Crystal Mitchell. We are looking forward to you guys sticking around today. Now, I'm sure they'll be here to help us with the Mr. Relay contest. But there's someone else who's going to be by my side, or should I say I will be by his side this entire day long. You know, he's, he's had it really easy this week. There's been nothing going on in Sierra Vista or Cochise County. So he, we finally woke him up today after being asleep all week long because nothing has been happening at all. There was no special plane flying over and uh, bringing in any sort of special guest. But the most special guest, other than all of you, is my friend. I would say my MC partner in crime, but that might get me in trouble, so I won't call him that. <laughs> Will you please make some noise for Cochise County's top cop, Sheriff Mark Dano? <laughs> Thank you, everyone. What an honor to be back again this this year with such a great cause and be up here with Warty and my buddy Jeff Davenport. And thank you guys for coming out today and spending the day with us because we're going to be here till 10 o'clock tonight, Jeff. Jeff and I are going to be sure? Are we going to stay awake that long? It's been a long week, Sheriff Mark. <laughs> trust me, I know. Trust me, I know. And, uh, <laughs> trust me, I know. But, uh, and we're going to have royalty back up here for the contest and some of the judging. Uh, Absolutely. It's great to see you. And I, I got to say, this, Jeff and I both were out last Friday night and Saturday when they crowned. You guys, you all wear the crowns. They all give them a round of applause. They Woo! did so well. Did so, well. So, so we'll get you guys back up here real soon. Sound good? Let's get to say something, Jeff. We gotta get to say something. Well, of course. Now, can we? Have, uh, let's 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 go down the line here, Brittany. Uh, congratulations again. Thank you so much for being here. What message do you have to say to the people here at the 2024 Relay for Life? How's everybody doing? Good. Woo! I think this is so cool because my mom is actually a cancer survivor. Uh, yeah! 
And of course, uh, oh, Sienna, good to see you here today. Thank you. Now, uh, any, any sort of encouraging message for the folks here today? Just have fun. This is a very important and big issue, and I'm really happy to see all of you here. Um, this has been an issue for many people in my family, so thank you guys for showing up. And, and on this end of the road, link here is Crystal representing Cochise County. Crystal, welcome. So what do you got to say? What do you, what do you want to tell everybody to be here today already? I'm going to put you on the spot a little bit. It's kind of like a, like a contest here. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. I'm just really proud of our little community. I know we're a small town, but when it comes to events like this, we all come together really well and just show support for everybody. So yeah, just love our little community. That's what you were. Woo! Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Royal Team. Appreciate it. Oh, we have the little one. We got the little oh, yeah, one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How are you guys? What, what, what is your name? Amelia, I don't know why I didn't have your your name on my list, Amelia, but you are amazing. I like how you're matching today. Did you did you plan that or was that an accident? We planned it. Oh, okay. <laughs> you, you planned it, and that's good. That that's, that makes it that pulls off the look together. Is are those real diamonds in that in that crown of yours? I do not know. I'm supposed to say they absolutely are. There you are. You are amazing, Amelia. Good to see you. Who is it? Oh, go ahead. Here, right sure. over here we got, now see, I don't have to get on my knee to talk to her. You have to, to do it. <laughs> but I'm going to do it, though. What's your name? Josie. Josie, you're Little Miss Sierra Vista. Is that, is that your title? Yeah. How old are you? Seven, turning eight tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No. Oh. What grade? Uh, third. I was going to see at least fourth, but that's that's good. So, <laughs> welcome to our show. Welcome here. This microphone's horrible. I'm just going to throw that up there. <laughs> well, we're glad to have all you guys here. All right, we're we'll each all back up here in a little bit for the royalty and some of the contests and some of the stuff we're going to do with the kids. You guys going to come back up with us? All righty. Give them a round of applause as they exit the stage. Thank you. Thank you to our royalty. Sheriff Mark, we have a very special person who's going to open us up. We do. Starting with prayer, our invocation. The Honorable Reverend Carl Peterson. Reverend, come on out here. I'm going to turn the mic over to you. Good to see you again. If you don't prepare yourself for prayer according to your tradition. Wonderful Creator God, we thank you for this day that you have brought us together. For the word cancer strikes fear into us, but we know we have no fear because we believe in you. And Lord, we know that you have received our loved ones and care for them and give strength to those who have the battle. Be with us today as we celebrate, as we honor you and we honor our loved ones. And may we bring an end to cancer that we may have full life with you. We pray in your mighty name. Amen. Thank you so much, Pastor. We appreciate that. Thank you, Reverend. And... As we are all, if you if you could stand, if you're able to, where you are, we would like to present the colors today as they get presented literally all around the state from the border all the way up to the amazing Arizona Cardinals Stadium there in Glendale and everywhere in between, even competing at national levels. Can you please give a warm round of applause to our very own Tombstone High School JROTC presenting today's colors. to honor America with the singing of our national anthem, Miss Jen Charest. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. Oh, the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming. And the
here to remain standing as the colors are retired. Please make some noise one more time for the best in the business, the Tombstone High School JROTC! And one more time for Chad Charest! Sheriff Mark. Now, welcome, join me and welcome to the stage, the Honorable, the best mayor. We've ever, I can't say that. The best mayor, come on out here. Mayor McCall. He can't say it, but I can. The best mayor that we've ever had! It's Sierra Vista, Cleo McCall. Thank you, Sheriff. Thank you, Jeff. Proclamation from the city of Sierra Vista. Whereas, the American Cancer Society is a nationwide volunteer health organization dedicated to preventing cancer, saving lives, and diminishing suffering from cancer through research, education, advocacy, and service. And whereas, Relay for Life is the national signature event of the American Cancer Society and the Sarah Vista Volunteers of the American Cancer Society will hold its annual Relay for Life on August 24th with the goal of raising more than $55,000 to honor 100 cancer survivors. Whereas this one day event celebrates the lives of those who have cancer, has survived cancer and remembers the lives that lost to cancer. Therefore, now be it resolved that I, Cleo McCaw II, Mayor of Sierra, Sierra, City of Sierra Vista, do hereby proclaim 24 August 2024 as Relay for Life Day in and for the City of Sierra Vista, in witness whereof I have hereto set my hand in the great cause of the City of Sierra Vista to be affixed this 24th day of August in the year of our Lord 2024 in the independence of the United States of America, 248. Cleo McCaw, Mayor. Whoa. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. He is. He's awesome. I tell you, he's out there. Thank you, Mayor, for everything you're doing for this city. You represent well. And we're going to bring somebody back up here. Donna, come on over here. Donna's going to actually read um, a mission moment. So, Donna, we're going to give you this microphone right here in the middle and uh, share this time. Here you go. Thank you. All right. Thank everybody for coming out today to celebrate and honor all those that have been affected by cancer. Um, I am a 26-year survivor of cancer, so this means a lot to me, as many of you know. As we live each day, researchers and doctors are working to make this disease on the road to eradicate this disease. This is one reason why we relay. So what do we do? We relay. Let's hear it. The other reason is to honor the survivors and to keep others in their, our memory. And why do we, why are we here? To relay. relay. Come on. Relay. relay. All right. I've got a poem I want to read, and I think everybody will understand if you've been affected. This is called Take Action. Cancer attacks those we love. It feels so wrong. So we cannot sit back and wait for what comes along. Cancer's days are numbered is, is the mindset we hold. We are ready to fight back, ready to be bold. When cancer's destruction is not to our satisfaction, it is up to us to rise up and take some action. As a group of people with a very strong will, we will not be quiet we will not stand still. We have fresh energy, confidence that is surging in this moment. Our fighting spirit is emerging. We will stop the momentum, stop cancer's advances. We will end the cycle and end cancer's chances. Staying defiantly and remaining bold, completely determined to break cancer's hold when cancer's destruction is not to our satisfaction, it is up to us to rise and take some action. Uh, thank you so much, Donna, we appreciate that. Thank you, Donna, we appreciate you. Well, are we gonna to talk to our presenting sponsor? Oh, Leah, you wanna come back up? Leah. 
Oh, okay. I'm just going to say a little something for Texas Roadhouse. Um, they brought the food today for the survivor meal. They get to uh, have a, one, of the, one guest join them for the event. And um, many, many years, well, even when, Sa when Saul was here, they started sponsoring this event. And um, I know they do a lot in this community, so I just didn't want it to go without uh, us talking or, or thanking them immensely for what they've done for our community over the, over the years and for Relay for Life. Um, they, they just step up and step up and step up. And I was in there the other night and that place is just packed and they sometimes are short on employees, but they make it out here. And thank goodness for my friends and my family because they're helping to serve the meal for the actual survivor meal that we're having this afternoon. So. Thank you, and if you get a chance, please go down to Texas Roadhouse and, and partake, um, have a meal there, thank them for what they do for us and our community. Thank you. Great. Well, we're, we're so grateful for the presenting sponsor, Texas Roadhouse, but we do have a platinum sponsor, and that would be Northrop Grumman, and we want to say hi to Mr. Brett Smith, everybody. Yeah. Hello. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure if they can see you. Go ahead and step out. You, <laughs> I just want to be brief, but I do want to say I'm grateful and humbled to be here uh, with all the survivors and the volunteers and the families, so it's an honor. Uh, Northrop's a long-standing partner with the American Cancer Society, and we participate in Relay for Life across America and all the communities, but it's a big, uh, big honor for us to give back not only to the, to the American Cancer Society, but to local communities, so I want to thank the Northrop personnel who participate, Paraton, I also want to thank, because they used to be part of us before we sold them off. And I also want to say thank you to the volunteers who made this happen, and thanks for the opportunity to brief on behalf of Northrop. Thank you. Thank you so much, Brett. We appreciate that. Thanks, Brett. We, we do have so that. many other sponsors to thank today. Our amazing presenting sponsor, Sheriff Mark. One of them is Periton. Anybody from Periton out there? There we go. Thank you guys so much. For All two out. of you, thank you. We appreciate you being here, Periton. <laughs> hey, they made enough noise for five, though. They, Absolutely. They at least. Five. At least. Who else we got, Jeff? Oh, of course, we have our good friends at the Texas Roadhouse. Thank you so much, Texas Roadhouse. Then we got our Platinum sponsors. Platinum, Northrop Grumman. We just heard from them. And Lions International. Thank you, Lions Club. We out there. I know Lions come down every year. I know they're out there somewhere. The Lions Club. They're always out there at all these amazing events here. And thank you to our gold sponsors, AWA Affirm Wealth Advisors, the American Legion, as well as... As well as the Sierra Vista United Methodist Church, SSVEC... You want to talk about our other sponsors? Go through the silvers? <laughs> While we're here, we want to recognize those. Anybody from uh, AAA Fort Storage out here today? That's because they're all guarding all their stuff over at Fort Storage. They're, they they're moving in and moving stuff out all day. But that's another organization that's coming up doing a lot for this community. Yes. Every one of these sponsors do so much for the community, so thank you for Fort Storage. The American Legion Riders Post 24 and Post 52. Sierra Vista and Tucson. Thank you guys over here. Give them a round of applause, everybody. And thank you for your service to this country. I don't know if they heard you come in, so you might need to go rev those up for us a little bit uh, in just a couple minutes here. Thank you so much to America and the Southwest Credit Union, as well as Cool FM Live that we're streaming on right now. You can share this video around to all of your friends. And the Legacy Foundation of Southeast Arizona that does so much, so much for the community here. And I'm thinking that's Canyon Vista Medical. What is the C? Uh, CVMA. C it is, it yeah, is. Okay. Medical, medical yeah. Associates, uh, uh, great to have them here as well. And a, and a litany of bronze sponsors that we have here, Sheriff Mark. Let's, let's give them some recognition because it makes such a difference. We're going to talk a little to Leanne here in just a minute. American Legion Auxiliary Unit 52 and the Arizona Ranger Service to come back. I saw them when I was coming in. And Desert Fever, we've heard from them already. Jeff, back to you. Ed Morris Automotive Group, La Society des Voitaires, 987. Laura Miller, Pepsi Cola Bottling Company of Safford, RV City, and Sons of the American Legion, Squad 52, Southwest Gas Corporation, Keith and Carol Wilson, and Yucca Movie Storage. And I gotta go back on something. Ed Morse, that's the new owners of Lollies. The one who bought Lollies House. He's that's gonna right. be in town next week meeting people. If you people haven't seen him though, I hear he's a great guy. So thank you, Sean and Kate, for all they've done from Lolly Automotive, been a big sponsor, but now we got the Morse team. It's gonna be awesome. Signature sponsors include Aries LLC, our good friends over at Culver's, Fesser Financial LLC, and Furry Family Chiropractic. 
and Jacob's Notary Service, LLC, Moose's Hot Dogs, Phillips Eye Care, Simmer I Sleep, Service to Aid, Ace Hardware, Service to Flowers, and I missed one, I always like to have you pronounce Tony's. Oh, that's fine. Ginger's Auto Title Service, Indochine Indo Family are. Restaurant, Sparks Furniture, The Body Shop, The Country Lawyer, and Williams Mellow PLC. You can see all of the sponsors that are here in your program. Make sure you snag one of these because it'll give you all the information on everything that is going to be happening all day long here at the park for the 2024 Relay for Life. And we have 23 Three teams. We had another team sign up here a minute ago. So 23 teams are going to be out here with us today. Leanne, come on back up here. Let's talk a little bit. I know you've been on the uh, our first watch sheriff show every Friday morning. Come here in the middle between Jeff and I. And where are we raised so far? This is a huge event this year. I know you had a goal the other day, and you're getting really close. This year, our goal is $55,000 to raise. And as of just the other day, we'd raised $36,000 plus. But I have to say that Northrop Grumman is such a gracious sponsor. They match every dollar that our team members make. And we have managed to make over $10,000. So we have another $10,000 to add to that number. So we are at least at 46, 47,000. And just to let you know, we have through the end of the year to raise this money. So, so it's not all tonight? We don't need to empty our pocketbooks tonight? It can be no, okay. you can next month, the month after again, until December, you can, you can keep donating to our Relay for Life. You just go on our website at www.relayforlife.org forward slash Sierra Vista AZ. We're going to raise it tonight. That, that's what this is all about. This is a fundraiser, folks. This is a fundraiser. We're going to do our darnest to raise it tonight, Leanne. And thank you for all you're doing for this. How many years you been doing this? 26 years. Now, Out of the 29th. I, I yeah. believe this is the 29th anniversary. Right. And, and Sierra Vista was the very first Relay for Life in Arizona. Whoa! That's amazing. That's amazing. a good trivia question, Sheriff Hart. It is. You'll see that at High Heat coming up soon. Trivia question. I also would like to, we have some other thank yous to shout out because not necessarily are they on our sponsor list, but without these people helping us, this would be, this would be very tough to pull off this event. Of course, we have our American Legion from Sierra Vista and Tombstone. We have the Riders, we have the Combat Veterans Motorcycle Association and the Black Horse Regiment. But besides that, we have our gracious year after year MCs. Sheriff Daniels and Jeff Davenport, Miss Sierra Vista Teen. Um, for our invocation, we appreciate Reverend Carl Peterson. We appreciate the presenting and dismissing of the colors from our Tombstone High School JROTC, our vocalist Jen Charest, and the band who will be back two more times throughout the day, the proclamation by the mayor, and then we have other sponsors such as sponsors for we have the Tombstone High School JRO to see the Team Periton, Gizmo's Friends, and Relay Rascals. They are sponsoring theme laps today. We'll have Country Line Dancing, Zumba. We have Cool FM Live. We have KWRB 90.9. We have the Eth Cherry Ethel Team. They did a spot for us the other day at Long Realty so we could get some advertising out this morning about the event. We, have, we were um, able to get little stickers put on the pizza boxes even at Domino's, Little Caesars, Papa John's, Pizza Hut, the Pizza Bistro, R&R &R Pizza, and Vinny's Pizza. We also had flyers put up at their, at their businesses. We have Home Depot that helped us out this year, Sierra Vista Ace, which is, he's, Les Orchikowski is always awesome in our community. We have Tractor Supply that, that donated supplies for us. We also have the Sheriff's Assist Team that came out today. They're back there to help out if we need them. Cherokee Community Health Center. We have our photographers. We have Verna Pelt, which I have volunteered. He's volunteered with our department for many years, over 20 years now, so I've known him a long, long time. And then we have Norman Beasley a little later in the day. We have the VFW that should be distributing water, I believe. The volunteers that came out for the setup and then the teardown later today, it's monumental without help. I can't do this stuff myself. I can't put all those canopies up with myself and my husband. He tells me, no, you got to get people to help you. We had uh, Pizza Hut, the Bistro, Subway, and Urban X. 
uh, yard that have given us, also that have given us prizes, and possibly Julie and Sammy's also. And a big shout out for the vendors that came out today. We have Bam Bam's Barbecue, we have Bussin Pizza, and then we also have the Little Bits Snack Shack that we should have today. So we really appreciate everybody's help on this event. You know, they always talk about putting an event together, whether it's Relay, a charity ride, the Cars for Kids, Jeff MC's at for us over there, and the many other events. It takes a lot of work. Thank you, Land. Thanks. It takes a great committee putting those together. You got something else you want to bring up on stage here? Yes, we, I believe at this point, I want to ask real quick, uh, Tammy over there, that we wanted to do a team lap with their banners. If we have any teams that have any banners or, or would like to line up. At the start, right out in front of me, Tammy's over there. Let me see if that's, if we got any team members that would like to line up. I know it looks like the Yellow Jackets are going over there. We'd just like to do a lab for them just to show our appreciation and let them know what their support means to our organization and in the fight against cancer. We can go ahead and do the little one side of the large lap. We'll just do the half lap. I see they got their flag there. We got some other people. We'll still do the survivor lap after we have our special guest, our honorary survivor come up and also read a caregiver poem. So let's, everybody, if you'd like, you can cheer them on over there on the track, the teams that are over there. Well, well, I was going to kind of let them do their thing just a little bit. Well, Sheriff Mark, it is going to be an amazing day here. We are so fortunate and so lucky that we get to be a part of this event again for however long we've been a part of it. It's absolutely awesome. Don't forget to get your selfie over on that uh, big purple chair there. Share that around with all of your social media friends. Let them know and let them know that you're here and that way they can stop by. I know you guys are watching on Cool FM Live. We're going to end that broadcast very shortly. It's Jeff Davenport Live brought to you by SSBEC, Sulphur Springs Valley Electric Cooperative, serving our community. But in the meantime, Sheriff Mark, what, what, what we have all sorts of fun stuff in store from hula hoop contest to uh, wet t-shirt or Frozen t-shirt oh, yeah. They're gonna be wet. Yeah, they're gonna be wet now. I don't know how they're gonna how they're gonna stay frozen. I'm and not we, sure. And we concluded with Mr. Relay. What a fun event. What a fun event. Please stick around, especially a nice way to do some entertainment tonight. They'll be up here. How many we got, Leanne? How many Mr. Relays we got tonight? Well, Mr. Relays, you'll have to come back and find out for yes. sure. And then we'll Definitely. see. Team 52, okay. One for sure. There we go. Step it up. So, so there could be a winner already. That's what right. I say. Process of limits. And for those who don't know, Mayor McCall will be the first in the dump tank today. First in. Thank you, Mayor, for stepping up. I get, we, get, we said you're the best. you got to go with us now. First in the dump tank will be Mayor McCall coming up here real soon. And, Jeff, let me say thank you again for letting me share the microphone with you. I mean, this guy has got stardom, but he's, you're going to see him. I keep saying it. You're going to see this guy on national stage someday. And I can say I shared a microphone with him. Well, I was rubbing shoulders uh, with uh, 45 uh, just on Thursday. I know, I know you, did, you didn't have that opportunity to, Sheriff Mark, but, uh, you know, it, it was great, <laughs> just so you know. It, uh, seriously, it was historical to have, it was, yeah. whether you like him or not, he was a president that served our country, and he was here in our county, sharing our community. So, yeah. between the mayor, myself, Jeff, you, and many, many other community members that came out and supported from the thousands along the highway that showed their support, and that's what this country's all about, and showing that support. And we know that this place is all about showing support. It's showing support and sending that love and the hope that we know we are... We are relaying for a cure. We're relaying for our family members. We're relaying for our friends. And that is what it is all about today at the 2024 Relay for Life. What's coming up next, Leanne? What, what are we looking at? All right. We are going to have our caregiver poem read by Misty Tufty, who is our honorary survivor today. And I would like the survivors and their caregivers to come up and get closer to the arch because that's where we're gonna start the lap 
once Missy is done, but she's going to leave the lab with her husband, John. And then after that, we will ask that Miss Jen Charest come back up for the Survivor song. I, I was asked to do the caregiver poem celebration. Um, caregivers honestly aren't given enough thought for what they do for those of us that have survived cancer. So I have been asked to read this. So I'm gonna ask all the caregivers I need the caregivers closer up so they're able to do this with me. Caregivers. All right. For all, for all the caregivers, I need you for just a minute. Come on, just, just a second, just the caregivers. Come on. Yeah, caregivers, come on up to the stage just for a second for the reading of the... Thank you, thank you, caregivers. This is a special poem just for you guys. No, you guys are good to stand up front. All right. I want you to all look at your hands. All the caregivers, look at your hands. It was these hands that cared for them. It was these hands that bathed them. It was these hands that fed them. It was these hands that worked tirelessly for them. Now look at your hands again. Now cross your arms. Cross your arms. It was these arms that lifted them. It was these arms that carried them. It was these arms that hugged them. Yes, these arms. Now, cross your arms over your heart. This heart that cares. This is the heart that shared. Yes, it was your heart that remained strong to help them through the fight. Yes, it was your heart. Even though you grew weary, you were made strong because you had to for them. Thank you so much for being an outstanding caregiver and supporting those who have battled this disease. We love our caregivers, and without you guys, we would be so much less than where we are today. So thank you all very much to the caregivers, and thank you for what you do for us survivors of cancer. And let's keep battling it. We live for life. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. So we're going to go back to those survivors and we'll get lined up for your lap as we get going and continue this amazing day here at Veterans Memorial Park in Sierra Vista for the 2024 Relay for Life. Good opportunity, too. I ride here just to socialize, get to know our community, and thank those around us. They've done so much. Thank those around us today. I mean, as we all come together to share a purpose, share a cause. We are now going to get our, all of our survivors that are in the group. They're wearing purple today. If you can please come over by the arch. We're going so to we're going to wrap up the broadcast right now. Thank you guys so much for watching this. It's an amazing day. Take a look around at the park, waiting for you till 10 p.m. tonight. You can be a part of the 2024 Relay for Life. Thank you so much for sharing this video around. Tag those cancer survivors, friends of yours, even if they're small. Let them know that there is hope here in Sierra Vista. There's encouragement here in Sierra Vista waiting for you. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Jeff Tapp for Life. Brought to you by SSBEC, Silver Springs. Valley Electric Cooperative serving our community. Have a great day, everybody. Come on out to the park until 10 p.m. tonight.